A ski sundown opening for the season today as its trails are finally ready and covered in snow. Yes, indeed. Fox 61's Brooke Griffin. Brooke, there's a lot we love about you. You have southern roots, but you're always up for adventure. So I have two questions. A, I think people are already turning out there behind you. I see some folks. B, have you skied or snowboarded? Okay, yeah, so there are already a lot of people here, including the ski team that's already practicing very heavily this week. Second, I may be from the south, but I do ski a lot. We used to actually ski on Christmas every year growing up. We'd leave the family part of it and go skiing every year for several hours. It's always been a lot of fun. Now, one thing, I did learn to ski on ice, though, because, again, it's North Carolina. So skiing on powder is totally new for me. I'm not very good. But I am willing to try, and that is something that we're going to do in the next hour or two. So tune into that. It might be good. It might be bad. Who knows? But we do have Bob here with us. He is the owner of Ski Sundown. Thank you so much for being out here with us this morning. Yeah, thanks for coming. Every, there's so many people here already. It looks like we got the snow out. How excited are you to really be open now? Uh, it just feels great. Can't wait to be open every year. But this year it's been a struggle, so it just feels really good to be open. You guys have been fighting weather conditions a lot over the past, what, month or so, just really trying to get that snow made? Really tough. We've only had about 30 hours of snow making, uh, but we're able to get 10 trails in. We're open for business, and it feels great. We already have a lot of people here. Is this a lot of return guests? Is this ski team? What are we already seeing so far this morning at, what, 8.06 or whatever it is? <laughs> yeah, so we have programs this week. Uh, we have the ski team is practicing this week. It's returning customers, pass holders. Uh, it's a variety of people. All right, and tell me a little bit about hours this week. It looks like they're pretty long days. You guys have a lot of hours opening, what, through January 1st, I think? Yeah, no, our hours now are uh, on weekends and holidays. We're open 8 in the morning till 10 at night. Weekdays we're open 9 in the morning, 10 at night. That's all the time from now, hopefully, till April. All right, and real quick, we have um, a lot of different amenities here. You have the lodge, different food, all these options. Is everything open and ready for business today? Everything is open and ready for business. We've been waiting for this, yeah. All right, perfect. Thank you so much for being here this morning. We are going to catch up with some of these skiers over the next uh, hour or two. I'm also getting on some skis. I've already got my pass hooked on my pants here. Um, again, it might be good, it might be bad. I'm at least willing to give it a try. And if I can't do it on TV, then what's the point? So we'll see how that goes. Um, I will toss back to you on the desk for now. We're gonna go get some skis on. All right, I can't wait to see it, Brooke. All right, Brooke, remember pizza to slow down, french fry to go fast. You got this, my